Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Prime, and welcome back to another Nino Kuni episode. Last episode, we left off at the Temple of Trials. Let's go. So we're not going to be able to save inside here, so hopefully it's just going to be a straight run. Head for the Temple of Trials. <coughs> oh, before I get too far, um, head over to our little friendies and... Um, where is it? Jason said that we have a new power of some kind. Tricks. Uh, there we go. Commands. Okay, so we got drowsy drops, healing tears, and water bombs. So, let's see. What are drowsy drops? Drowsy drops affect point so soporific bubbles. Okay, okay. Element is dark, I think. Let's see, it's fire, water, light, dark. Mm. I don't remember. Uh, bubbles and a single enemy to dreamland, so you can cause them to fall asleep. Um, let's see, healing tears. Point a healing tear drop. Point a healing. Okay, effect shape is point. Oh, instead of like area of effect or damage over time, stuff like that. A healing teardrop falls, restoring all, uh, restoring a small amount of health to one ally. And then we have a water bomb, which is point, and it's element water. A rippling bubble of water is launched at an enemy dealing water damage. It takes four MP. That takes four MP as well. Um, Jason, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you water bomb for the moment. Uh, if you want something else, just let me know. Um, what do you? Oh no, not you. What do you got, monkey? Uh, you can only do one thing at a time. Pebble pelt. What is pebble pelt? A well-aimed pebble deals physical damage to a single enemy. Uh, sharpener. A secret in. Cantation boosts the attack of a single ally. Oh, I will keep that one on. All right, and did we get any new spells for you? Let's see, we've got Cut Loose. Um, oh, what's the smash hit? Yes, we'll use that. Uh, effect point and pent up energy pummels a single enemy dealing damage, dealing physical damage. Okay, hold up. Uh, cut loose is a field attack. So a barrage of random slices deals physical damage to all enemies. I like that better just because it's an AOE. It's an area of effect. Sandblast is a stinging cloud of which it's only one person though. Point, field, point. Uh, so we'll, we'll keep it on sandblast. Actually, no, we'll, we'll put cut loose back on there. Or can we? Can we not do cut loose? Oh, we already have cut loose. Let's do smash it. There we go. Uh, and then let's see what the, the what Gogo -Go has. Oh, um, we have healing tears. That was that healing thing. Uh, and then thunder spark is a point. An electric surge of deals damage. Bleh. An electrical surge deals storm damage to a single enemy. Uh, what else do we have? That's it. That's it. Let's get going. The temple at last. The trials await. Blimey! It's proper impressive, this place, eh? Shrouded in an air of potent mystery it is. Did you expect less from the sacred haven built uh, to try the mighty sages? Did you train here, Mr. Richard? Richard? Of course. All who bear the name sage must pass the trials. So, Alicia would have taken the trials too. Oliver? To become a sage, the can candidate must possess purity of heart. Brand. Brand. Brand of knowledge. A lot of knowledge. And mystery of. Uh, mastery of both spells and familiars. <clears throat> the temple is both test and tempers all of these qualities. And if you can't, if we can't pass the trials, there's no way we'll ever be able to beat Shadar. Is, is there? Oh wait, she's got an accent, doesn't she? My, my bad. Precisely. But even these gifts granted you on passing the trials will not be enough. You will need to need a far greater power to defeat the dark jinn. 
Well, I guess we'd better just focus on the trials for now, huh? You are ready. It is time to release the seal. Don't break the seal! Sorry. Comment down below if you got that one. Ooh! He broke the seal. Beyond this door awaits the Supreme Sage. It must be opened by your own hand. Wait, what? Yes, sir. Hmm. A little bit of coffee before the trials. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Good deal. Oh, he fell down. Mr. Drippy. Let's do this. Dude, you were locked in here? Are you okay? He's got a face. I saw that near the saves. Uh, we, uh... So this is the Supreme Sage, is it? Ahem. Your Honor, we have come to perform the trials. I wonder if his, uh... Not... Me. Huh? Idiots! Oh. I'm the Supreme Sage! Oh! That's just my stupid servant, Umboka! Oh, wow. Okay. What? Huh? Greggy! We got the wrong one! The Temple of the Trials, Proving Ground of the Sages. I don't know if his shirt's supposed to be doing that with the weird triangles, or if that's just some graphics card problem. <clears throat> I can't believe it! The Supreme Sage is just as sweet as sweet little boy. Sweet, eh? Huh? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, Your Honor. I don't care. I am sweet, and clever, and handsome. <laughs> I'm just so modest. I don't like it when people talk about it. Oh, I see. How did you lot get in here anyway? Only people with my permission are allowed to open the front door. It has been a long time, Your Honor. Is that you, Rasha Rasha Rashad? I keep saying it wrong. Blimey, when did you get so old? <laughs> You're ancient. But you have not changed at all, I see, Master Solomon. Did you know my father when he was young? <laughs> How strange. Uh, Father, you mean your... Yes, Your Honor. I present my daughter, Esther. Please forgive her rudeness. <laughs> I don't care. What I care about is having a daughter. How did you did that happen? You were always so shy. <laughs> and rubbish. Oh well, congratulations. Anyway, what are you doing here? What, are you, what do you want? These children, Master Solomon, Oliver and Esther... I would ask that you allow them to take the trials. Really? If you're recommending to them, if you're recommending them to me, then oh gosh, you must think they're pretty good. That or you've gone bonkers in your old age. <laughs> I see great potential in them both, but they lack power. Beginners, are you? And you want to get stronger? Why? What for? I. I need to... I need to defeat, defeat Shadar. What? You beat Shadar? You do realize what you're saying, don't you? Yes, Your Honor. And I'm going to help him. Oliver helped me, and now I'm going to pay him back. Hmm. Fine. But the trials are hard. Really hard. I know. Because I made them. We're ready, Your Honor. Ha! It looks like you might be... Okay, I'll get... Uh, I'll let you do them. Thank you, Master Solomon. We'll pass all the trials, you'll see. You have my thanks, Your Honor. Then I th I will take my leave. You're going to leave already? Boring. Uh, you, should j you should stay here. What's wrong? Scared of me? Uh, scared to see them fail or something? <laughs> He's right, man. After all we've done for you, the least you could do is stick around and see if the two, uh, see the two through the flippin' trials. I cannot. I have duties of my own to attend to, like bananas. I will not 
uh, I will not remain a Baban Babana seller forever. I must prepare to walk the path of the sage once more. <clears throat> That's not the real reason, is it, Father? Why are you... Oh. <sighs> that is not the real reason, is it, Father? Why are you so desperate to go home? Don't you see? He wants to go take the trials without any help. He wants us to take the trials without any help. He, we have to prove that we can make it on our own. You're right. Okay, Oliver. Let's do our best. Good luck with your preparations, Father. Don't sell any babanas with, will you? Don't sell all the babanas, will you? Hmm. <laughs> of course not, my child. When you complete the trials, you shall all have babanas. Have all the babanas you could wish for. Good luck. <clears throat> Come on, all this talking is boring. Let's start the trials, shall we? Go and ask the stupid old Umbopa, 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 whatever, about what you have to do. Oh, and everybody just like disappeared. What in the world? Hey, we can save. Better do it now. I don't want to have to go through that thing again. Yep, 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 yep. Create new save. Woo! Hello. Umbaba will explain. <coughs> Umbaba will explain the trials. You will listen. There are three trials. The first trial is the test of wits. The second trial is the test of friendship. Past these trials and the third trial, the test of strength, it is the final trial. But first, you must pass two trials. The first two trials are the trial rooms to the left and to the right of here. To learn about these trials, ask the trial monitors in the trial rooms. Good luck in the trials. It's a lot of trials, dude. Okay, okay, uh, this... Oh, no. Always follow the star. Oh, wait, there's two stars. Dang it. Now I'm confused. Okay, fine. We'll go to this one first. He was standing on this side, right? Boom! First, the trial of friendship. Friendship is magic. The test of friendship. Yay. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> oh, okay, fine. All right. Monitor bird. Matt, well, Matt, this is a trial of friendship. The word, the, <laughs> the road will open only to those who trust in each other and walk forward as one. Stand atop the glowing switches and to begin. Uh, oh dear. Okay, so I have to move the left one to move Oliver and the right one to move Esther. Oh gosh. Okay, that's that's wickedly hard. Okay, fine. Let's just run forward, shall we? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh, this isn't too hard. Okay. Uh, I got a little bit of dexterity on me. I'm not all that crazy and not that old. Ha ha ha! Boom! Oh wait. <laughs> I gotta stand, step on the next one. Okay, fine. No! I wasn't looking at that side. Okay. Are we... Is this... Okay. I wasn't sure if we ran back or not. Here, I could always just move one at a time. Oh wait, what's this? Aha! No! <laughs> I'm not so good with my right finger. Or my right thumb. There we go. Forward. Right. And you have to wait there. I have to go across here. Hit that. And we can move you up here like this. I bet there's another one. Oh, come on, Oliver. Oh, there it is. There it is. Boom. Yeah, yeah. Please tell me this is not all the way back. Oh, it is. It is. Run. Run, Esther. Go, girl, go. Whoa. Dang it. <laughs> okay, fine. I'm just going to try and speed run this. Let's do this. Come on, come on, come on, go, go, go. Hit it. OK. 
Go, go, go. Yay. Whoa, that's a little bit faster than I thought it was going to go. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Perspective, perspective is different. Oh gosh, oh gosh. You go up there, you go, stay right there, stay right there. There we go. There we go, I just, I do it one at a time, see? That's easy. Easy enough, right? You step there. There's one, two. Yay, we did it! That was pretty cool, not gonna lie. Trial number two. <laughs> now that you're finished with the warm up. Wait, what? Excellent! You have demonstrated the strength of bond between you and passed the test of friendship. So wait, does that mean everybody had to come in here as twos? Um, what if you were a single sage trying to do the trials? Then what friendship would you have had? Yeah. I hereby present you with proof of your achievement. You obtained the proof of friendship. Stand together and face the hardships that await you, and believe in one another above all else. Do so and you will always prevail. We will. Thank you very much, bird. Can I talk to you? Trust will always companion to the child and blah, 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 blah. <sighs> to be honest with you guys, I really don't like reading. <clears throat> What's wrong? Are you nervous or something? You need to learn to relax. I can't stand watching you squirm like that. Okay, fine, dude. Uh, let's say this real quick. You want to save? Yes, I want to save. Save it. That way if we fall or anything happens, we don't have to worry about it. That would have been horrible if you lost like 10% of your things. A test of wits. 10% of the guilders. All times. <clears throat> well, Matt, this is the test of wits. The powers of perception and reflection are the key to the solving of these puzzles. Show me the wisdom upon which your kind prides itself, child of man. Alright. Guess I'll stand here. Go on, boy. Show those trials who's boss. I'm cheering you every step of the way, man. I didn't mean to... There we go. Okay, so... There's 12, 12, 12. Uh, I bet that's a spell. Hold up. Puppet string. Yeah. Okay. Select the statue. Move it. Okay. I've never used this one before. Nice. It just kind of locked in place. Finish moving. All done. Okay. Didn't work. Hmm. So wait, why didn't it work? Uh... Yes? Hear a hint, bend the test. No. No, we don't want to abandon the test. Okay, three of those things are enemies. One of them is a familiar. Look around the room. Is there any... You know what? Let's go get a hint. I don't want to sit here the entire video. Here a hint, here a hint, here a hint, yes? Here a hint. The dragon sees the warrior's sword while the bird is shown the shield, his shield. And the beast, meanwhile, looks to his right and sees an empty field. Wait, what? Okay. The bird sees the warrior's sword. So, well, wait. The dragon 
sees the warrior's sword, while the bird is shown his shield. Meanwhile, the beast looks to his right and sees an empty field. So his right would be... Okay, I got it. I got it. Okay, let's cast the spell again. Puppet strings. All right, first things first. Let's go to that bird, the, the beast. Oh, that, uh, oh, no, this, this one here. All right, so you're going to see an empty field. You are going to be over here. The bird sees the shield, and the dragon sees the sword. Sword, warrior, bird, and beastie. That wasn't hard. I mean, with a hint. You had to get the hint, though. Like, there, there was no way just to randomly guess that. I mean, you could randomly guess, but then that would be a very boring video. Okay. Uh, it looks like a puzzle. we got to make the face. So, yeah. Okay, fine. Puppet string. Does it cost five every time? It does. Okay. It's just a puzzle. Uh, we cannot rotate, can we? Um. Oh. Oh, there we go. That worked. No, no. Oh, this one, this one, let's see. It goes right there. This one goes down here. This one goes right here. That one goes right there. Where does that one go? I only see one angle and it's way down here. That doesn't feel right. Why does it not feel right? No. There we go. The face. Perspective. Coffee break. <sighs> okay, come on, we gotta hurry. I've only got about ten minutes left, and we've got to pass all the trials this round so we can get to the next episodes. Okay, this doesn't look fun. Okay, fine. Let's go talk to the bird. Yes? Give me a hint. The bird is bound to the dragon and the moon. And on the star he sits. Okay, so the bird has to sit on the stars. And is bound to the moon. The bird is bound to dragon and the moon. The beast links the warrior in the moon. Wait, what? And star. Yet knows not where he fits. Wait, what? The beast links the warrior, the moon, and the star. The warrior, the moon, and the star. Okay, so I only see one spot that has three connections. Um, hold on. Can I take a picture of that? I'm going to take a picture of the clue. There we go. Is there another part to it? it oh, I get it. The bird has to be able, uh, has to be on top of a star, and the lines have to join up with a moon and, the, and that dragon there. Eh? Okay, I think. Maybe. Who knows? 
puppet strings. Alright, so the clue was... The bird is bound to the dragon and the moon and sits on a star. Okay, so let's go to the bird. He has to sit on a star and he's bound to the dragon and the moon. So, there's the dragon. It has to sit on top of the sun. The bird is bound to the dragon and the moon and on a star he sits. The beast links the warrior, moon, and star. So the beast, warrior, moon, and star. Come on, no, up, oh, there we go. Like that, yes? Okay, cool. Had to get a clue, didn't I? <laughs> I guess I could have just Googled it. But we're not doing that. Here we go. <clears throat> Excellent. You have demonstrated your wisdom and passed the test of wits. I hereby present you with proof of your achievement. You obtain the proof of wits. It's like a diploma. Keep your eyes and... Oh, wait. Keep your eyes and ears ever open to uh, the knowledge you will gain will serve you well. It may not always be brute force that wins the day. Often the word is mightier than the deed. I understand. Thank you very much. Bird. Bird, bird, bird. Bird, 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 bird. bird is the word. Sorry. Okay, so we've passed two of them. We're at 26 minutes. I hope I can get the next one done in four minutes. You passed the first two tests. Not bad. Now we know that you're good friends and that you're not completely stupid. And we also know that my powers of encouragement and support work miracles. Tidy. Hey, you had nothing to do with this. Oh, wait, she's got the accent. Hey, you had nothing to do with this. I did not do an accent there. Anyways, Oliver, it's time. The final test? What is it, Master Solomon? Ha! Everyone knows that. It's the test of strength, stupid. Oh my gosh, he's so mean. This is the test of your combat abilities. You've guessed what you have to do, haven't you? We've got to fight somebody, huh? Oh, you aren't too clever. Oh, wait, aren't you clever? But well, not just anyone. <laughs> You're going to get your heads beaten in. Okay. Oh, but I didn't want him smashing up the place, so I've prepared a special place for the fight in. For you to fight in. Anyway, you probably need to rest first because you are so small and weak. I'll be waiting here when you're ready. Yes, Your Honor. Wait. So what? Okay. Oh, okay. He wants us to heal up our magic. Got it. Yeah, we're saving our progress. Because if I die, I don't want to have to come all the way back through all those dialogues. It's time for the test of strength. Are you wimps ready? Yeah. That's what I like to hear. Good luck in there. You'll need it. So where does the last trial take place, Master Solomon? In a special secret place. Watch this. Door, door, up from the floor. Abracadabra. Okay. Amazing. He co he conjured a door out of thin air. <laughs> thin air. Wow, I cannot do it. You have to go through it to get where we do the test of strength. It's a little place called the Solosium. Solosium. <laughs> Tidy. You ready for the final test, Ali boy? We have to pass it. We just have to. I'm ready. Come on, you guys. Sorry, guys. My nose is actually starting to clog up a little bit, so all my accents are sounding very nasally. Into the door we go. This is the final trial. This looks a bit flipping serious. 
Jeepers! Oliver, look! That's kind of creepy. Bashura, the final test of the Temple of Trials. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's send him out. Oh, I did not stop it. Oh, God. Ooh, ouch. Okay, you know what? We need to come back and we need to be casting some spells. Oh, Ollie boy, this beastie's by... Wait, this beastie's by here's got a big old shield protecting his back, ain't it? Better give him a whacking from the front, I reckon. Okay. Wait. Uh, it just turned blue. Can I hit the attack button? That didn't do anything, did it? Go on. Hey, it was a counterattack. Nice. Oof. That does a lot of damage. Provisions. Oh, no, she's doing fine. Okay, we're good, we're good. Uh, spells. Pulse. Do it. Oh, 41 damage. Let's do that again. Oh, 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 ouch. I keep thinking I'm gonna fall off. Let's do that pulse again. 37. Come on, Ollie boy. One more. Pulse. Oh, uh oh. Hold on, hold on. Don't get hurt. Spells. Healing touch. Defend! De oh, I missed the defend! Ooh, 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 spells! Healing touch! Heal her up! Hurry, hurry, hurry! I don't want to switch yet. Spells. We're going to do healing touch one more time. Uh, 27, 22. We're going to give it to her because she's still attacking. Oh, go grab that. Yeah, 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 yeah. And let's try Frostbite. That did 39. Oh, defend. Spells. Pulse. Do it again. Okay, that's all I got. Go get him. Oh no, devastation again. I gotta defend against that. Oh no. I thought if she died, like, bad stuff. Go get the health, go get the health. Got it. I'm sorry, Esther. Attack him. Defend. Okay, show me what you can do, Jason. Oh. Evade. Attack. Oh, goodness. Yeah, okay, sorry. Uh, give, give another hit in there. Give another hit. Okay, switch. Six, seven, six. 
Psych up. Psych up. Psych up. Go wild. Do it. 17, 16, 17, 13, 13. Get him, buddy. Get him. Do one more attack. <gasps> Yay. We did it. So wait, does that mean Esther failed and I won? Or are we still doing the whole, like, teamwork thing? I, I don't know. Nice. Good job, everyone. Good work, team. We got the Spirit of the Temple times one. Nice. And Dodo learned something. Bashura. You obtained a page describing Bashura. Yay. Hey, you passed the test of strength. You obtain the proof of strength. We did it! Oliver, we did it! We sure did. That's the last trial. You've passed them all. Oh, I got a... I got you a guardian... Uh, sorry, graduation present. Here. You received a page describing the bridge spell. You received a page describing the broom broom spell. What is a broom broom spell? New spells. Thank you very much, Master Solomon. Tidy. They look like proper useful ones, too. Of course they are, stupid. He is so mean. I wouldn't give them rubbish ones, would I? Anyway, it's time for the main event. My specialist subject, familiars. I'm going to teach you the secret of creature taming. Creature taming? Ooh, it sounds interesting. <laughs> you're a bit annoying, but at least you're enthusiastic. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> Don't ever be this mean. That's that's just rude. And is it a baby Yoda on top of his uh his chair? I mean, this was what, 2013? We didn't even know what baby Yoda was, but that is a baby Yoda if I ever saw one. I'm just saying. Okay. Enthusiastic. Okay, first let's talk about surrendering. What's surren surrender surrendering? Serenda, Serena Ding. Serena Ding! What's a, what's a Serena? I don't know. I'm just about to tell you. Aren't I stupid? Wow. Yeah, no comma there. Aren't I stupid? Uh, it's something that you can do. It's something you can't do without a special instrument for, for a start. An instrument? So that means. Yep, leave it to me, Oliver. I'd bet you'd. I'd better give you it before we carry on. Ubampa! Ubampa. Master? <laughs> Master. Here, take this. It's called the Heart's Winning Heart. Wow, it's beautiful. You obtain the heart winning heart. It's not just beautiful, it's useful too. You can play it to tame creatures and make them your familiars. It's probably easier to show you than explain. You're quite slow after all. Oh, okay. I've prepared three creatures for you to tame. Pick one that you like uh, the look of. Yes, Your Honor. You can tame the creature during battle. Try it out with one of these. Th with these ones. Don't look so scared. The They're my pets. They won't attack you. Huh, <laughs> wimps. But how do you do I tame them? Well, every now and then, when you beat a creature, it will be so impressed, it will fall in love with you. If that happens, yucky hearts will appear above its head like this. Hee <laughs> hee. Aw, that's sweet. <laughs> Ugh. Anyway, you see the hearts. It's time for you to play the uh, a serenade. If you manage not to mess it up, the creature will become tame and join you as one of your familiars. That seems simple enough. It doesn't matter who beats the creature. It can still go all gooey girly and lovey dovey. But only you can tame tame it, Ether, Esther. 
So if we want a creature to join us, Esther has to play the song? I just said that, didn't I? Stop asking stupid questions and give it a try. Yes, Your Honor. But which one shall we pick? Why do you have a flip... Wait. Why do we have to flip and pick? Can't he give us the whole lot of them? Stingy old so-and-so. What's the matter? Spoiled uh, for choice? Well, when you're finished moaning and groaning, just let me know which one you want to give you completely for free. Um... That one's kind of like me. I mean, he's just not stopping. But this one looks like reggae, not right by the beach. You know what I mean. I bet we could have some fun with this one. But this one looks a little handsy. <laughs> Let's go with this one. He looks like he's a... He's got... He's not really got hands. He's holding two of those slap hands that you get out of the little quarter machines. This one's like... Toot! 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 Pick me! Toot! No, no. Not doing that. Let's go with the reggae man. Hee wee! <laughs> this cute creature is, is called a naiad. A naiad. A naiad. So there. It's not very good at normal attacks, but it's got some decent magical ones. And it's a great healer, so it's helpful to have around. You should definitely choose one, that, that one, over the other two. They're rubbish. Oh, okay. Buddha, Buddha, wait. Ba do be do ba ba, pa pa par up, parp. That stupid looking one's called a shonky honker. <laughs> it's got a good defense and magical attack, and it can put enemies to sleep as well. It's a bit of an all around, I guess. I suppose. You should definitely choose that one over the other two. They're rubbish. Wow, you just call all of them rubbish, don't you? Boo! Hee hee hee! This one's called a boogly boo. It has. <laughs> it may have a stupid name, but it can scare the pants off people even worse than me. It packs a hefty punch, and it can learn some pretty nasty tricks too. Hee 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 hee. You should definitely pick that one over the other two. They're rubbish. I don't know. Okay, so this is an all around. This one's a. This is a like a hitter and scarer. This one's magical attacks. Let's go reggae. Okay, let's, let's play this one. Uh, do I have to do something here? What is that? How do I how do I switch? Yes, we want to pick this one. This one. This one. Can we pick this one already? Pick it. Pick it. Pick it. Do I have to pick this guy? Have you decided which one you want new familiar yet? Yes. Really? Oh, the same way. Blah, 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 blah. Serenade. Now to the battlefield. Stay calm now. Okay. Right then, daughter of Rashad, are you ready? You're the only one that can use the harp, so you'd better try it out, hadn't you? Uh, okay, so we have to pick her. Right, listen, there are three creatures you uh, here. You have to pick one to be your new familiar. You know how to tame your creature, don't you? First, you have to beat it in battle. Then, one of your... Uh, one, I mean, uh, these ones are my friends, so I've told them not to fight back when you bash them. Well, come on, beat up a creature, and it will be your new best friend. That doesn't sound right. There we go. Do we have songs? Chirpy tune. Don't know what that does. What are you two doing back there? Okay, so beat it up, right? There we go, got it. Now we just hit the heart, right? Ha! Look at that! It's up on its feet again. Creatures do that sometimes whenever you beat them in battles. Those yucky pink hearts over its head, that means that you can tame it. 
If Esther's near a creature with hearts over its head, she can use her heart command. And then she uh, and then she can choose whether to play a serenade to tame it or to let it go back to the wild. But if you choose uh, if you don't choose quickly, it will run away, run off anyway. I've told these ones not to run away because you're a beginner and they prob you're probably rubbish. Okay. Serenade. You've tamed the lagoon na 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 blah blah blah. Haha, <laughs> thumbs up. Okay, uh we gotta pick somebody from the comment section. So let's see who commented on yesterday's video, or today's video technically, and we'll figure out somebody from there. Let's see. If you were lucky enough to leave a comment, then you could be chosen to be uh, in the next video. And your character would be chosen at, uh, at random from me if I like your comment. If you leave a bad comment, you're not getting anything. <laughs> so, leave comments down below if you want. Uh, let's go over to the uh, video section. And I need to choose yesterday's. And we're going to go to the comments. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I only have seven to pick from. Not bad. So, uh, you don't look painful. Blah, blah, blah. You're at number on Roblox. Talking about Roblox. Uh, you're the fifth comment. GG. Third comment. GG. Second, third. Okay, so the only person that actually left me a comment instead of saying first, third, second, or stuff like that was Fezzik Jr. So, Fezzik. You're going to be my new pet, Reggae Man. You're going to be Logan, Lagoon. Okay. Uh, so, let's do a capital F. Then we hit the button to do lowercase. Easy, Z, Z. Where is the Z button? Why is it in order? It's not like a keyboard. Fezzik. Capital letters. Fezzik Jr. Boom, boom. There we go. Boom. Done and done. Confirmed. Are you sure you want to name him Fezzik Jr.? Yes. Fezzik Jr. is now your familiar. <laughs> Screenshot that. <laughs> we did it. We tamed a creature. <laughs> Not bad for your first try, I suppose. Like I said, anyone can beat up a creature, but Esther has to play the song in order to tame it. So you'll have to go to work together if you want to get more familiars. I know it's hard for selfish brats like you, but you'll just have to try. Yes, Master Solomon, we understand. Neato, huh, Esther? Oh, and you can have three more you can have three more familiars, as well as the ones you use in battle. Tidy, but what happens if if we get all overexcited and tame more familiars than we got room for? Then you'll have to speak with a uh, wait. You'll have to speak to a little friend of mine. Look over here there for a second. <gasps> yes. Hello. Hello. The dark creature that comes out of the sewer to drag our familiars back to the place of darkness. Esther, what a funny looking thing. Is he a familiar too? Don't be stupid. <laughs> That's the rep from the familiar retreat. Or rep representative from the familiar retreat. He'll take your familiar so you don't uh, need off. Wait. He'll take any familiars you don't need off your hands and keep them safe back at the retreat. Where's the retreat? It's in hell. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, there's useful. Looks like you'll be keeping busy then, huh, Esther? I'm looking forward to it. I can't... No. <clears throat> I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait to see what kinds of creatures there are out to tame. Out there to tame. You can find familiar retreat holes in every town... <laughs> it didn't sound right. In every town that you visit. Uh, a... <laughs> And even in some dangerous places, too. 
I think I've been some places and I've... Wait, I think I've seen some in places we've been already. You have. Hang on. Your familiar's ready to metamorphose. Wait, what? Look, your familiar's ready... Meta what? Blimey, I have to teach you about that as well, do I? You don't know anything. Fine, I'll teach you about metamorphosis too. But give me a break, will you? Explaining this is going to give me a face ache. Okay, let's save. Save. Quickly. <sighs> Completely restored. Yep, save it. Save it. Save it. Yep, create new save. Done. Okay. Alright, we gotta talk to him again. Okay. Right, it's time to teach you about metamorphosis. This is boring, so listen carefully. I'm not explaining it again. If you look, you can see a familiar wants to metamorphosis. Uh, and for that one, you'll need one of these. Here. You obtained a sun drop. Nice. This is some kind of treat? That's not just any old treat. Just look, uh, just try it, will you? Uh, I'm bored of talking. Give it to the mite that you've got there. Feed it to him. Wait. Feed it to him in the creature cage, you mean. Okay. Here goes. Okay. Give him the sun drop. Here you go, buddy. Wait, what is this? New species. Is that what he currently is, and that's what he'll go to? So he's a mite right now. I can't select, so he turns into a mighty mite. All right, Just Jack, are you ready? Just like more metamorphosis into a mighty mite. <laughs> I thought the mighty mites were like the little kids um, football team. Never mind. The number of different tricks Jazz Jack uh, has been increased. Jazz Jack can perform in battle has been increased by one. Nice. Neato. Look at my familiar. That's metamorphosis. When you're familiar, it gets big enough, you can feed it special treats to make it change into a new version. Metamorphosis. Got it. When a familiar metamorphosis, they get stronger, look different, and learn better tricks. They also get to gobble up more gems, meaning you can teach them even more tricks. The treat you need... The treat you need to feed a familiar to make it metamorphosis depends on its sign. Something you never would have worked out on your own. <laughs> wow, you are so mean. Oh, and here's another piece of priceless wisdom you don't deserve. <laughs> when a familiar metamorphosis... When familiars metamorphosize, metamorphose, they go back to level one. But that doesn't mean that you're back at square one. Once you train them up, you'll be much more powerful than they were before. Whether you metamorphose your familiars or not, it's up to you. Some idiots prefer to stick with the same ones they've got. Do you want that? I don't care. Do what you want, I don't care. Now you don't have anything else explaining. Wait, you don't need anything else explaining, do you? You're fine with what I've told you, right? Yes, Master Solomon. Good, I hate explaining all that stuff. Anyway... If you want, why don't you just write a book and then like leave it at the front steps? That way you don't have to be bothered. You're gonna be this mean to everyone. Anyway, if you want to hear all of Born's details again, you can just ask the Born old telling stone you've got there. Did somebody see my name? Eek! It is his high supremacy says. Wait, it is as his high supremacy says. I can replicate his explanations in minute detail at any time that you choose. You need only ask and... Boring! Ugh, you haven't changed. Anyways, now go. Uh, now you know how it all works. You can get out of there and tame loads of familiars and make them metamorphous. Thank you very much, Your Honor. Ta, your suprema di 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 Right where, where to next then? Can we go back to Alamamoon real quick? I want to see how my father is getting on. Sure, we'll go ask him about the other great sages, too. Goodbye, Master Solomon. Thank you for everything. Don't mention it. I mean it. Shut up. Get lost. 
Thank goodness that's over. <sighs> Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Nino Kuni, The Wrath of the White Witch. With me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos, but it's up to you. Check the links down in the description if you want to purchase your own copy and those affiliated links from uh, Walmart and from Best Buy for the PlayStation 3, the PlayStation 4, and the Switch. By the way, disclaimer, those do pay me. If you actually click on those, then I get paid um, if you make a purchase. But don't don't, uh, don't take my word for it. If you want them, go for it. If not, that's cool too. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. And we'll talk to you very soon. Outro.